During a storm, we are at war with mother nature. These avalanches can be deadly, and the best way to mitigate them is with explosives. Here at Mammoth Mountain, it's a blast from the past. We literally use World War II cannons. Fire! Detonation. Detonation. My name is Matt Seibert. I'm a Mammoth Mountain Ski Patroller. On any given day, we can see anywhere between 5,000 and 18,000 guests. We try to keep a constant watch on the mountain and changing conditions to create the safest environment possible. Steep slopes, large snowfall, intense winds are all recipes for an avalanche. I've worked in our artillery program here on Mammoth Mountain for the past seven years. The Howitzer was originally a World War II weapon of war. Now discontinued in the war theater, it is now a valuable tool for avalanche mitigation. Our whole team feels secure when the gun goes out and fires. It's able to reach targets that we would not normally be able to reach with just throwing hand charges. Detonation. Clear Our intent is to create many small controlled avalanches as opposed to letting the snow rest and winding up with one large devastating avalanche. We fire our gun 90% of the time blind in a storm without being able to see our target. We are capable of dialing in on one tiny little rock and nailing it on the nose. The risks are real. Um, upper mountain wind slab is considerable danger. Each day we arrive at work, we put our name on the board for accountability. We go out together, we work together. At the end of the day, we come in together, take our name off the board, and we don't stop work until the last one of us is in for the day. I do take joy knowing that there are families out here recreating, having fun, bringing up the next generation of skiers and snowboarders, enjoying the mountain. It's a job I love and it's my goal to create the safest environment for our guests.